What is annotation scale? What advantages are possible to achieve by automating scale settings in a drawing? In this first class, we will answer these questions and others on a relatively new concept in AutoCAD. Not too long ago, it was quite difficult to display skilled elements in AutoCAD. You had to use several layers, one for each skill factor, calculate object sizes to fit the desired skill factor, and after that... Many steps were required to adequately display a model in several skill factors. Beginning in AutoCAD version 2008, element display in different skill factors has been automated, thanks to the annotation scale option. And then, you just have to select an element compatible with this resource, and then enable the automated skill resource, and specify the skill factor to make these elements visible. This way, the automated skill resource helps you to speed up your design work. You just have to define the entities which will be displayed at different skill factors, and define the skill factor display. You can also use this resource to hide some elements you wish not to display at a given skill factor. This is useful when you want to display dimensions for a specific detail of a part, and then this way the skill factor display is different than the rest of the drawing. So in this class you have studied about the benefits of the annotation skill resource for automating skill factors in your design work. Use this resource to save a great deal of time on your drawing.